Good morning, everyone. Thanks for joining us for Catio Chat this morning. Loki with his fluffy pants. We're going to take us to the kitchen. Almost to the kitchen. Looked like he was heading downstairs. There we go. We got some lights on. It's quarter after five. There's Miss Muffy. Here comes Luna. Here comes Bear. Loki should be there somewhere. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so we're all up, and we got up a little early this morning because I know that it's too cold to do a catio chat outside because we're supposed to get some snow today and and tomorrow. So it's just still, or almost there, but it's not quite there yet for temperatures. Anyway, since I'm standing so close to the pot, I'm going to turn it on. Here we go. It's nice to sit down with a cup of coffee. This early in the morning. <laughs> oh, there's our little Miss Muffy. Yes, she is. Miss Muffy is our oldest kitty. She is 24 and a half. Yeah. But you'd never know it. And she puts the run to kitties outdoors and everything else. And she puts the run to these guys too when she needs to. Let's turn some lights on in here. Find out where Loki is. Here's Loki. Hi, buddy. Here he is. He's waiting for me to go to the basement with him. Hi, buddy. Oh, here he goes. Two fluffy bums. <laughs> yep. Loki gets in bed with me right at uh, the time that he knows I should be getting up. So he knows five o'clock for some reason is why I have to get up. So he climbs in bed with me for about 10, 15 minutes, but he won't give me any more than that because he's trying to get me to get up. So that's why. And there's Bear. Bear's talking. I can hear him. Maine Coon cats are so funny. Every time they move, they make this little trilling noise. It's so sweet. Oh, there's some straws. Good looking straws too. Right? Yeah, those are good straws. Good for picking up off the floor. Let's come see Miss Muffy. Here she is. Yeah, so Miss Muffy is very, very, very old. Oh, there goes a golly wampus. <laughs> she is very, very old. <clears throat> the great thing about it is her body isn't really quite, hasn't caught up to her age yet. She's uh, still in pretty good condition. Here's a lady, Lou. There she is, having a pick. Yeah, do you think you might want to go outdoors? You can try. It's kind of chilly. Yeah, it's very chilly. Snow flurry chilly. Willing to get a breath. Your beer, he's having a bath. <laughs> so, um, in the past couple of days, we've been actually building a, a catio for Ginger. And if you don't know who Ginger is, he's my mother-in-law's cat that they newly acquired. He needed a home, and they needed a cat. So I'm going to shut this door. <laughs> Too cold for Luna. Yeah, so we've been spending the day, or the last two days, in the basement doing some woodworking, which is always fun. So the catio that we built for them, it's kind of a portable unit. It just, um, you just set it in front of your window and open your window. And when you don't need it anymore, you just um, pull it away from the window and put it away for the winter. So it's really quite neat and um, it's not 100% finished, so I won't take any pictures until it is. Right there, there's our Luna. She's a boss kitty. Yep. She's got an itch. <laughs> yep. So uh, that's been fun. Building the catio for Ginger. And uh, he's already tested it out. It doesn't have a permanent roof on it yet. Or I would take some pictures. But it uh, just needs a roof. And that's going to go on today. And then uh, Ginger is going to have his own little outdoor catio 
it's not a giant thing, but it's, it's good enough that he can get outside and move around in the, in the big box we made him. I'm trying to remember what the measurements are. It's quite, quite big enough to, uh, well, go out and turn around and lay down and that sort of thing. It's nothing like our big catio, but it's a nice little catio. He can go out and it's facing the sun so he can sleep and feel the, the sun on him. So that's going to be fun. I think the roof is going to be finished today, so I should be able to get some some good pictures. There's some geese. Here's Miss Muffy, Luna, and Bear having a bath. Yeah. Yes, so this is my morning routine. We get up every day about this time. We're trying to get up later so, uh, so we can do our catio chats outside on the catio. That's where we started. But we had to bring it in for the winter. And now we're trying to, we're just waiting for good weather so we can go back outside and do it. Yeah. Like yesterday's catio chat. We'll just start out there and they'll have their, their morning treat. And that's what we'll do. I was kind of hoping to be able to do it this week, but uh, today and tomorrow we're supposed to have snow flurries and rain. So not a good, uh, not a good combination for going out on the catio. Here's our big boy bear. He's our polydactyl cat. Bear's got uh, eight extra toes. Come check. You want to get up here? Bear's got eight extra toes on his mittens. Big mittens. Yep. You gonna go up? He's thinking about it. <laughs> Miss Muffy having a stretch. Yes, so this is our kitty family. Miss Muffy is the oldest one. Let's see, Luna is nine. Bear, this guy here, he's eight years old. And Loki's seven. So we kind of Got a whole bunch of Maine Coon cats all at once. <laughs> yes, it, it's really, really hard not to have more of them because their personalities are just so special. Yeah, Miss Muffy's pretty special too, though. All cats are special in their own ways, anyway. You want a pet? Oops. There. There's that face. <laughs> He's a very lovey boy. Who's not lovey? Um, they're all actually lovey kitties with us. Absolutely. Yeah. Because they all get up on our laps. They get in bed with us. Very affectionate. So they're pretty much just like Miss Muffy. Yeah. So probably should wrap this up soon. And come in here and see Loki and Miss Luna and Miss Muffy. Should wrap it up soon and call it Catio Chat because we've seen everyone and everyone's in good shape. There. Yeah. There's Luna. We didn't get to see much of Luna yesterday. We'll get a look at Luna when she gets her face out of the tube. There. Luna's our female Maine Coon cat. She's a beautiful girl. She looks like she's always dressed up. <laughs> Here's our little Miss Muffy. Miss Muffy has arthritis and she's deaf. But otherwise, she's in good shape. <laughs> there. And Luna's our next senior in line. Oh, I think maybe Loki wants to go outside. Hey, Beard! You still there? Let me see if Loki... Oh, I thought I heard Loki scratching at the door. I guess I didn't. So anyway, we got to wrap this up and call it Catio Chat for today. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you tomorrow.